Well, I was holding an American flag. New Zealand Gandhi. No. You're not being it. reasonable, you're not willing to be diplomatic with us. What's wrong with you, you guys? Just, want following to us. Us. just yeah, following waters doesn't cut it, you know? You know you're only doing your job. It didn't cut it in the Nuremberg trials, it won't cut it now. Yeah. They were pretty interesting, the Nuremberg trials. It showed how we've actually got a lot of rights. We have the right to assemble under democracy. We had a democratic right to assemble. We have a right to disperse information under Section 14 of the Bill of Rights Act. Section 14 says we have the right to distribute information of any kind in any manner we wish. Read it, Section 14. Section 14 of the Bill of Rights, guys. Enforce it. They asked me where I came from, I didn't tell them. And this whole country is in grief. And they're going up and down, they're angry, and you can understand why people are acting like they are. And they've, no one's ever seen anything like this before. This is unfamiliar ground for everyone. And they're frightened. They're frightened. Most people have lost their jobs. Um, I have a lot of grandchildren. I'm fearful for them. I'm fearful for the next generation who've got to pay this big debt that we've got. It's a huge debt. So, yeah, I'm here for my country and I'm proud of it. I don't want to get into this COVID stuff, but the point is, this is why I'm standing here for everyone here. I'm not their spokesperson, but I feel this is very important. And I know through mental health, how people's health is going to be affected. These elderly people who are on their own in nursing homes, and they can die from just being isolated and alone. Can you I know? So that's a really big worry for me. Can I ask one more question? So there's been an issue around the testing at the border. A lot of the numbers, they were saying that they were testing the border workers and those at the quarantine facilities, and they've said today that actually only 60% of them have been tested. How does that make you feel knowing that those those numbers that they were giving us originally do not quite stack up with well, the truth? Well, actually, um, I don't believe anything I hear because when I hear Ashley Bloomfield apologising to the public that there were an elderly lady, number 22, who was supposed to have died of COVID-19, she was 96 years old. She was tested twice 
had negative results a month later she died. It was proven she didn't die of COVID-19. And he apologised for his mistake, but he still left her as number 22. So how can you believe that? Down in the South Island, there was a, um, a village, a, a Pitchner's village, and uh, DHB tested one of the staff who had flu-like symptoms, and they said she had COVID-19. So then they tested an elderly lady there who had COVID-19. And then this staff member went and got another test, and it turned out she was negative. She had two negative tests. They went back to the elderly lady. She had a negative test. I think it was Oakley or something, nursing home. And DHB had to go and apologise. And they said, oh, we've got the wrong nursing home. No, how do you believe what you are hearing? It's very hard to believe. So you can see why people question. Yeah? Perfect. Thank you so much, ma'am. Well, well said. <laughs> You are breaking right. COVID. I'm simply asking for the law. Can oh, you show me the law? Asking, to leave, asking you to leave. Under section What's 14. Name, and, uh, Look, here come the stormtroopers. Come try arrest us next week. There's a thousand of us coming here. Thank you. All Thank right. you for Bring going home. What about all these people? What about all these people? Look after yourselves. Keep yourself safe. What about these people? Are they essential? Disappointed to put everybody at risk. Are these people doing essential business down here? Oh, the best business. Yeah. <laughs> well done, mate. Are you gonna start arresting people for protesting? Yes, we are. You are? Arresting them for breaching the COVID Act. COVID okay? Act? Yep. So, Does it unless say you're we... here on essential business, I huh? suggest you go home. I'm just, I'm just making a video for Can 17. you stay two meters back from me? Yeah, yeah, sure. Thank you. 